Hey, really guys, it's just Travis here. I know I fooled you. I know you didn't know the difference here, but uh, hey, before we get on to this awesome recipe that I'm going to go with you tonight, um, it's Saturday night, 7 o'clock, I'm at my home, going over some uh, new plans for some upcoming promotions we'll be doing with our camps, but uh, you know, you may ask, why am I dressed like Richard Simmons? First of all, I respect the guy. You can hate him, you can love him, but the guy changed lives. And that's what I love about him. As I was growing up, you know, watch this guy. He was dynamic, diverse, took a different approach to the way that he got people to lose weight. But you know what? He was effective and he changed thousands and thousands of lives. And a lot of people made fun of him. I get it, but I don't care, man. He was effective in what he did. But the real reason I'm dressed like this, if you are a tribe member of one of my three fat loss uh, camp locations, you're one of the 200 members, uh, that are actually tribe members. Next week is retro week, okay? So you're gonna dress up in retro's 80s uh, workout gear. Go to the academy, go dig up in your attic, get your leg warmers out, get your flash dance on, get all your Jane Fonda gear out, and show up for workout in your attire, okay? So, not only are we gonna have a lot of fun with that next week, each camp will have a winner at the end of the week that gets $100 cash for best outfit, okay? For best 80s, uh, workout gear outfit, I'm going to be paying you $100 cash. So, what we're going to do is you're going to show up next week, wear your workout gear all week long. You're going to come to at least two workouts in your gear next week. Uh, one of the trainers is going to take a picture on their phone. The following week, we're going to lay the pictures out and let your peers and uh, the camps go by and vote on who they think they had the best outfit. Not us. We're going to let everybody in the camp, all of our tribe members, all 200, Get to vote in each camp and see who the winner of their camp is. Gets $100 cash. So if you're not a member of our camp, you don't understand what we're doing here, is we have a lot of fun in our camps, okay? I mean, you know, working out, getting in shape is a good thing. It's positive. But, uh, you know, sometimes it's just like, oh, man, you know, I got to go do this. I need this uh, for all kinds of reasons. But, you know, we can have fun doing this also. It doesn't have to be boring. And that's what I've been about for years is changing up the workouts, giving new programs, challenges with Badass prizes, okay? Uh, I, I continue to go further and further in, in my uh, rewards that I want to give to people for taking eight week challenges, six week challenges. You know, right now we're finishing up our 2013 New Year's Revolution where people have been getting paid $10 per pound to lose, okay? I mean, I think we're at like, we did $7,000 on the first round, we did $4,000 in this last round, and we're getting ready to do our final weigh in, and we're looking to get $13,000. Our 1,300 pounds lost for over the three month period, and uh, that's gonna be awesome. And uh, let me give you a little taste of something here. If you are not a member of our fat loss camp, one of our fat loss camps, this next upcoming program that I'm gonna motivate you to get in uh, great shape for summer is gonna be off the chart, okay? I'm blowing away last year's prize. Uh, each camp this year is gonna get a grand prize. It's not gonna be one grand prize for all three camps. Each camp is going to have their grand prize, and when you see the grand prize, you're going to wish you were in our camps getting in shape, first of all, as a priority, but having a good time, dressing up, and then going for this grand prize each camp is going to receive. So, hey, if you're a member, good things coming at you, baby. You're going to love it. I'm uh, always looking out, trying to make things bigger and better, reaching for new goals, reaching new for things to motivate you, keep you going, get that body you deserve. Speaking of bodies deserved. Man, I'm telling you, we're going to interview this lady next week. I'm not going to give her name out right now, but I talked to her this morning, and she just, I mean, she just touched my heart by what she's talking to me with. First of all, I'm going to show you this lady. Some of you may know her, but this is this lady's uh, before picture, okay? That's what she looks like right here. This morning, I took this picture myself. Here she is now. Look at her, A, cheese and smiling. Look at her face. Look at her body. I mean, this woman is making off the chart. There we are. Look at this. Boom. 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 Okay, this is what we do, all right? I mean, we have a good time. We're not about just workouts, okay? I mean, we do. We provide awesome workouts. We are about results, okay? We're about transformation. We're about change. And we do it day after day after day. And a lot of you don't see all of the changes that we make in all of our camps, okay? Because we're kind of, we're a tribe. And we're in our own little world. And I mean, you know, we don't have to go out there and market and tell everybody what we're doing because it happens every day and people see it everywhere. But this lady, man, you know what she told me? I got tired of being the victim. I got tired of being a victim and every excuse in the world of why I was looking like this. She said, I, I just cannot continue to say, poor me, 
You know, well, this is why I can't, and this is why I'm fat, and this is why I'm out of shape, and this is why I can't go work out. And one day she stood up and said, you know what, enough of being a victim. And I said, you know what, I never thought of it that way. And what an approach she has made. And this morning, I was teaching this camp, and she came up to me and she said, that lady in the back that's just starting out, that was me. I, I couldn't do all the exercises, but y'all continue to tell me to modify and, and to do what you can. You don't have to be perfect, and you made me feel like I was part of something here. And then one day I got better, next day I got better, and now here I am. And I mean, bam! And she's going to tell you in that interview how much weight she's lost, how she did it, what she went through. And listen, nothing's easy, okay? But, you know, this is worthwhile what she's done. I mean, this is incredible. And she just looks in the mirror and goes, I'm not going to be a victim today. I'm not going to find an excuse not to go work out. I'm not going to find an excuse to follow Travis's eating plans. And that's the deal with our camps. We give you the full package, okay? It's a blueprint. We hand it to you, okay? I'll say this. You have to do your part. You have to be accountable, okay? I can't do it for you. I wish I could. But you do have to do it. But we hand it to you where you don't have to think about it. We give you a detailed eating plan. We give you DVDs for the days you can't make it so you have a workout at the house. Uh, we give diverse workouts that change every time. And I've got the best instructors, hands down. I'll stand right on that. In the state of Oklahoma, these women are just badasses. They're, they're energy, motivating. They care. They actually care. Know when people aren't there. Um, I couldn't ask for a better team. Okay, so listen. If you are on the fence post and you've been watching us, you know, year after year, being a victim, okay, I'm going to let you try us out for 21 days for $21, okay? $21 for $21, uh, 21 days, a dollar a day, okay? All you gotta do is call Tamara, 509-8844, tell her, hey, you know what? I wanna try 21 days for $21 to see what this is about. And because that way it's low entry, you're not out of a lot of money. You gotta put some skin in though, baby. Okay, a little bit of skin, that's a little bit of money there. 21 bucks, give you 21 days. See what it's about, see what all the excitement's about. See the craziness we do. So anyway, if you're not, you've never tried this before, it's been a long time since you have been uh, in one of our camps. You're like, man, Trav, I remember what I used to feel like when I was there and how good I did and I, you know, I started losing weight and then I fell off one day and I just never came back or whatever the excuse was. Whatever made you a victim, if you want to turn that around, give us a call. Okay, once again, members, next week, 80s workout gear, 100 hours cash, okay? Just having a good time, working out all week long. Okay, this recipe today, I call it healthy chocolate peanut butter cups. I actually think they're like Reese cups, okay? Very simple. Here's the three things you're gonna need. You're gonna need chocolate, ultimate muscle protein, okay? If you're one of my tribe members, you're probably using this. If you're not, you should be using this, okay? This is not a multi-level marketing deal, Vialis or all that stuff, that's great. I know nothing against them. This is strictly a protein that you buy and you use, okay? No one's gonna call you, trying to get you to sell it and all that. This is just the best protein as a fitness professional that I have found out there for years and years. I've used it on my clients for over 20 something years. It's awesome. So UMP, ultimate muscle provider. If you can't find it, Call me and I'll get it for you. Email me at tlcfitness at cox.net. Probably any chocolate protein will work if you've got it. I don't know the consistency of it, but this definitely works. So if you've got this, use this. Protein. You need some creamy peanut butter, okay? Doesn't matter which kind, just some creamy peanut butter. You need some regular, original almond milk, okay? Don't get the vanilla or the chocolate. Almond milk. All right, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna start off doing, getting one third cup. Let me bring this down here so you can see it. I know you just can't stand not looking at me in my outfit. Did you see these shorts out, man? Check these shorts out. These are bad. All right, here we go. Bring it down. Whoa, here we go. Right down here so you can see what's going on. Right on the muffin pan there. Okay, you're gonna start off doing one third cup of the protein, all right? Chocolate protein, one third cup. Bounce it out here. So one third cup goes out in the bowl there. Then you need one third cup of the almond milk, okay? Very simple. One third cup almond milk. Yep. Pour it in there. What you're gonna do next is you're gonna simply make a little uh, mix. Mix that up till you've got like a little cake mix. Take just a second there, get all that protein in there, let it get 
Make sure you get all the protein completely saturated by the mix. I expect to see some of you tribe member men in leg warmers and a tutu. Get that tutu out. I know some of you got one in the closet. Okay, so here we go. A little chocolate mix there. By doing one third of each, at least with the uh, ultimate muscle protein, it makes it like a little thick cake out of it. Okay, now, this is a regular muffin pan. I had a mini muffin pan. I don't know where it went the first time I did the round of this. So I'm using a big one. If you've got a mini one, do a mini one. If you're going to do a big one, this is only going to make four. Uh, and you're not going to go to the top of these, okay? It's going to be about halfway, but it'll make four of these. So balance it out evenly. So you take your muffin pan, okay? We're just going to use four squares. You're going to make a bottom layer with this mixture, okay? So you just do a little spoon in there equally to all four sides. Get you a knife here so you can get that down there. Make sure you cover the bottom of the muffin pan. Definitely. So you're making a base here is what you're doing. So take your mixture, make your base, okay, of each one. Okay, so you got the bottom. These are very easy, they don't have to be all perfect, even though that's what I'm trying to do right now. <laughs> okay, so you've got a base there. Still got too much in that one. All right. Okay, so this is what that looks like. So you just got a little base there at the bottom there, and that mixture, I tested it out on this big one before I did this video, will cover the bottom of four. So make sure you got down there on four. Then, next thing you're going to do, you take your peanut butter, okay? Just kind of clean off your knife here. Get a little, some peanut butter there on the uh, knife and put it right in the center of that mixture, okay? You're not, by no means are you using as much uh, peanut butter as you did mixture there. So you just get, you know, you don't have to weigh it, measure it out or anything, put that on there. Put that right in the middle. Remember, think about it, you're making a peanut butter cup, so that's gonna be in the center there. You're gonna take another round, put it in the center, like so. And in the center again on the fourth one. Okay. Making this one over like the runt of the family. Keeps getting the short end of everything. Aha. Okay, simple enough. Okay, so this is what we look like now. Let me bring this down a little bit further. So you've got a bottom layer, and then you've got a little peanut butter in the center there, okay? Just a little bit, you put it right in the center. You're gonna take this, put it in the freezer, okay? Hear those words, not refrigerator. We have done a recipe in the past where you used, um, the refrigerator, you need to put that in the freezer 15 minutes, okay? So you take this guy, put it in the bottom or whatever your freezer is, 15 minutes. Then you remove it. What I want you to do next is make another mixture of the one-third cup of protein, one-third cup of almond milk. Mix it up again, make that cake batter. Then you're going to put it on top and cover the peanut butter on the all four, okay? So you put it on there until you can't see the peanut butter. Just take your teaspoon or a tablespoon. These guys right here, take you a scoop, cover it, so the whole peanut butter is covered up on all of them evenly, where you make it look like a little cake. Put it back in the freezer for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, touch it, make sure it's hard. If it's not hard, leave it another 15 minutes, you're not gonna hurt it. Leave it in there for 30 minutes on the same time, and then when you're done, when they come out, whoop, whoop, they look like this. This is after sitting for 30 minutes in my freezer, and they come out, they're hard, 
Just like this right here, they got the peanut butter, you can't see it, but it's inside of the guy. So you've got a protein, pure loaded protein, uh, peanut butter, chocolate protein mix there. Awesome stuff, it's like a Reese's cup, okay? A healthy one. So, once again, I'll put the recipe at the bottom of this video, but you're gonna make your mixture, make a bottom layer, put some peanut butter on there, 15 minutes in the freezer, bring it out, make your mixture again, put it back up top, cover the peanut butter, can't, can't see it evenly, Use all of the mixture too. Use all of this, okay? Don't skimp. Cut up in four. Back in the freezer for 30 minutes, maybe 35, 40 minutes if it's not hard yet. And voila, great little snacks. You cannot go wrong with these. Uh, you know, when we're eating healthy and we're doing right, sometimes you just need that little sweet kick and no one that I know of doesn't like a Reese's Cup. And I think this is just awesome. I think you'll love it. Let me know uh, what you think about it. And once again, hey, if you want to get off that fence, quit being the victim. Call Tamara, 509-8844. Tell her I want to try you out 21 days for $21, and we'll hook you up. Welcome you to our family, and we'll rock and roll. So, hey, all you tribe members, I will see you next week in your 80s outfit. Just sweat it out, baby. I love you. I'll talk to you soon.